Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be my 35 week pregnancy update. Um, I haven't posted a pregnancy update, I believe, when I was 32 weeks. So I decided to make one today. Um, but I'm going to be turning 36 weeks this Monday because my, um, my weeks roll over every Monday. So every Monday I'm a new week. So this Monday coming up I'll be 36 weeks already, which is so crazy. So if you guys haven't watched my previous video, I had put up the name reveal of our daughter and what the baby girl's name's going to be. So I'm going to go ahead and say it right now. So if you guys haven't watched that, um, stop watching this and go look over on my other video that I just up I uploaded. The name that we're going to be naming our daughter is going to be Juliana and I love that name so much and... The reason why I decided to go with that name is just because I've been watching, I watched um, It's Judy's Life for the longest time and her first daughter is named Juliana. So I've been watching them for so long so I fell in love with that name ever since, you know, I started watching them. So I decided to go with Juliana because I love that name. And for the middle name, we are going to do, well I decided to do um, Bella. And I love the, the, the name Bella and also because... In Italian that means beautiful so it's going to be Juliana Bella and then my boyfriend's last names this past Sunday I actually went I actually had my baby shower and uh, that was about a hundred people at my baby shower um, from my mom's family side and also my boyfriend's family side it was really really nice I um, got a lot of gifts and I appreciate everything that I got. I got so much stuff. And I was planning on doing like a baby shower haul video. But that would be so, so long that, you know, it's like overwhelming. I wouldn't be able to show all that. So maybe I would just give you guys like a quick overview of what I got. Um, and not go in detail with everything because there's so much stuff. And that video would probably be like two hours long or more. If you guys don't follow me on my social medias, definitely go on over on my Facebook page and you guys could see all the pictures that I uploaded from my baby shower. So if you're watching this and you went to my baby shower, thank you so much for everything you got for me and thank you for coming. It was a really nice baby shower and I didn't know what to expect because this is my first baby and it was my first like party, like I never had a party for myself. Or, you know in general so it was like overwhelming and then it was just very overwhelming with the gifts I got like it was so much stuff I wanted to go ahead and talk about the furniture um, the crib was actually bought in um, I had put in the crib set the dresser and the change topper at my registry so the crib was actually purchased from um, Juliana's godmother to be which is my cousin, which is Tatiana. Um, she went half, there actually a couple people went halves on it. It was my two aunts, um, Tatiana and my grandmother. So, yeah, so the crib's all set. Um, so I appreciate that. Thank you guys so much. And that was such a nice gift of from you guys. Um, and then from the dresser, it was my boyfriend's brother. And then the chain and chopper was my mom. So, I'm just waiting on those two things, but the crib is all set, but I'm just waiting on the dresser and the chicken and topper, so that should be in before next week. And the baby's room is already all set. Um, we just need to get the furniture in and start putting stuff in the room and organizing and stuff like that. So I want to show you guys my diaper bag that I got from my baby shower. Uh, it was actually bought in from my mom's cousin. Uh, like my third cousin. It's off my registry. I love this bag. I fell in love with it ever since I've seen it at Babies R Us. So this is the bag right here. It is gray, pink, and white and it has a elephant on it. I thought it was so cute and yeah it's such a nice bag. Um, you know me. I already packed some stuff in here. Um, I think it's never too early to pack and I can always switch things out and put things in. Um, because I never packed a diaper bag before so I don't know what to expect and I feel like the more you bring the better because you never know if you'll need it or not. Today's the 19th of August. It makes exactly one month until my due date but you never know if I can go in early than that so yeah today makes exactly one month until my due date so I told you guys that we did our maternity pictures at Target so those came in on the 10th a couple days before my shower 
I picked them up and I loved all the pictures um, and they're already in um, frames because they were on the tables at my baby shower. I'll show you guys this little collage. This is the first picture. This is a 5x5 five five and this is it right here. So this is my boyfriend. We have two holding the ultrasounds. I love this one facing the back and then this one just looking at my tummy. And then down here, if you guys can see, it kind of cropped it out a little bit, but it says Juliana on it. So that is one of the pictures. The next one is a 8x10. This is a bigger size picture. And this is it right here. We're just holding the J. Um, so yeah, this is actually one of my, this is my favorite one that we took. So, yeah. And this is just one that he's kissing my belly. Um, so, yeah. My mom and actually my boyfriend's mom actually got teary-eyed when they seen this one. I don't know what it was, but they did. And then we did get a few different kinds, but I'm not going to show you guys all of them. Um, but I did want to show you guys this magnet that I have on my refrigerator. Um, and it looks like this. It's just a gray and black picture, uh, black and white. And he's just listening to the baby. Supposedly he's listening to the baby's heartbeat. Or, yeah, so. I love this one. I figured I showed you guys this because it was at my baby shower. It was, like, on the table. And, um, my dad actually got me this frame. So, it says the first trimester, second trimester, and third trimester. So, look how small Juliana was. This was at seven weeks pregnant. This one, I believe, was at 23 weeks pregnant. And this one was at 26. So, yeah. And actually, tomorrow, I have a doctor's appointment. Um, so, tomorrow, I have a doctor's appointment. And then next week, I have to go to my doctor's two times. I have to go the 24th on a Wednesday. Um, just do a doctor's checkup appointment. And then the 26th, I'm going to be doing a... I believe it's going to be my last ultrasound just because my doctor wants to see how everything's going and just check it up. So it's going to be like a checkup ultrasound. I don't know if it's going to be my last one, but uh, I believe it's going to be my last one. So I wrote everything down on this notebook so that if you guys see me looking down, that's why. So that is pretty much it what I want to talk, talk to you guys about. Now let's just go ahead and talk about the baby, how it's developing um, and stuff like that. And then I also want to talk about my symptoms um, since I've been having a couple symptoms these past couple weeks. She is as big as a pineapple, uh, which she weighs 18.1 inches and 5.07 pounds. That's the, that's the range. Um, she could weigh more. It says you can expect to gain about a half a pound a week before birth and baby's briefing up to at 35 weeks. Some moms to be feel like they have a ton of stuff left to do before baby's arrival, which I feel like I have a lot to do, like, um, talking about, like, nursery-wise, um, I know it's only August 18th, but, you know, tomorrow makes exactly one month until my due date, but you never know if I can go in earlier, so I'm just, like, the type of person that wants to get things done quicker, and then it says my body at 35 weeks, it says frequent, frequent to pee, yep, your baby's getting your, yep, your bladder is getting pressed by baby, which is one of my symptoms. Um, I've been feeling like I have, like when I go pee and I get out, and then like two minutes later, it feels like I have a full bladder. And I told my doctor that, and she did a urine test to, to make sure it wasn't like an infection, but everything came normal. So she was like, "It's definitely your baby on your bladder." Increase in the amount of contractions you're having. You know, I never experienced contractions, so I don't know exactly what they are. I just believe that they're like cramps um menstrual like feeling like menstrual cramps and then like a lot of back pain and those are two of my symptoms that i've been having i've been having you know i haven't had it recently but a couple weeks ago like maybe a week ago or two um i would just get done peeing and then i feel like i was getting crampy like a menstrual cycle um i felt just like crampy and it will only last like maybe five minutes like it lasted like five minutes and then it went away but it was very strange and I was like concerned about that I did talk to my doctor about that she said it's the Braxton Hick contractions but I never experienced it so it just felt like cramps to me 
the other symptom is um, back pain. I've been having a lot of back pain, lower back pain, and if I'm standing for a certain amount of time, my back starts to hurt and I have to sit down. Like um, I will just be sweeping the floor and then my back will hurt. And then I just have to sit down and rest for like a couple minutes and get back up. And I feel like it's been doing that a lot lately. Like, um, it's like constantly happening. Like my back, like my lower back is hurting me. And yeah, I've noticed that the past couple weeks my back's been hurting me. And lately, like I've been feeling like her come to my side. It feels like she's up in my rib. Um, on my right side, it feels like she's on my rib. Like, like right below, right below my, my chest. So I can feel that tightness and that like pressure and it feels weird but so if you guys are concerned what's this in the background, it's a bassinet. Um it's already in my room. Um so yeah, and then I just have my diaper bag right in there. It's actually it's usually where I'm standing right now, but I have it over there because I need to film around this area. So yeah, that is the bassinet already. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Make sure to comment down below. And before I go, let me just show you guys my belly shot for this past week how much it has grown so so this is the belly 35 weeks pregnant front and then this side So thank you guys so much for watching and then I'll see you guys in my next video, whether it's a makeup video or pregnancy update. Um, I will see you guys then. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. So bye.